So today's episode is about how I found cheap Montessori shelves. So I've been wanting Montessori shelves for a long time and I'm gonna link some Montessori channels below, but basically the idea with them, I'm gonna read him a book while I talk or show him the pictures while I talk. So the I, they're behind me, as you can see, cause this is where I film videos anyway. But the idea behind a Montessori shelf is that it's the right height for a baby. So or a toddler so that they can access their toys by themselves. So um, as you can see, he can reach everything. And then the other idea behind it is that instead of having toys in a, like a bunch of toys in a box or in a bin, which is kind of the default and kind of the easiest thing to do, the idea is that if you spread out the toys on shelves that the baby can reach, then they will be more interested in the toys because they look nicer and um, and then it also can help you feel good about your house looking nicer and it's just a simple little thing to do however it might not be so simple because Montessori shelves can be expensive real wooden shelves are expensive um, so I really wanted to invest in some but we were also moving and so I didn't want to get them until after we moved. But then I found these at Costco and I got them. Okay, so what these are are shoe racks. And they work well as toy shelves because toys are not as heavy as books. So that's what I'm getting at. These wouldn't work, like if you want, you know, bookshelves made out of real wood are important for books because books are really heavy. However, you don't actually need real wood for Montessori shelves. And these are a really pretty option because they're not made out of plywood, they're made out of bamboo. But they're still finished, which is really nice. And they're also low enough to the ground that even though they're not heavy, he doesn't really tip them over because of where his center of gravity is at. Of course, he's pretty tall for his age. And I'm sure that you could figure out a way to attach them to the wall. We didn't want to make any holes in our walls because we're renting but I'm sure that you could like wrap something around one of these back poles and then screw it into the wall so that the baby can't tip the shelves over. So I wanted to show you the box that they came in. So the brand is Trinity and it says two tier bamboo shoe rack and I found them at Costco for $32, which it just, they just seem really great for that price. Like they're not super flimsy or anything. They're not bookshelves, like I said, but they're not super flimsy. Like I have this other shoe rack right here with all of our shoes on it. I don't know how much you can see it in the camera, but this was like $20, I think, at like Fred Meyer or Walmart or something. And it, is pretty flimsy and it's also tall enough that he pulls it over on him a lot and it doesn't look as pretty because it's not finished um, and also the slats are so big that you can put toys on top now of course that works well for a shoe rack and it looks pretty cute and stuff but this in comparison even though it's still a shoe rack works really well as Montessori shelves and that's basically what I wanted to tell you. So, yeah, I'm super excited about it and I hope that maybe some of you can get this. I'll link below where I found it online if you don't have a Costco membership or if it's not at your Costco. And thanks for watching. Like if you liked it and subscribe. And maybe I'll do another video about what I put on the shelves. I'm still kind of figuring that out because I don't know what toys he actually likes to play with at this age, besides <laughs> almond milk bottles, which don't look that pretty on the shelf. Anyways, thanks for watching. Bye.